Hey guys, I'm LB, and we are back for maybe the final episode of Disoriented, because if you look here, we've completed all of these, completed all of these, and now we just have these last, what, one, two, three, four, five, six levels left? Yeah, this is where we left off before. Doesn't seem like we have much left ahead of us, so... Let's get started, shall we? What happens if we go over here and rotate this thing? Okay. Does that actually change... which way it rotates us? No, it doesn't. Huh. I'll leave that alone for now. Seems like we have a potted plant right here that needs some... water. There we go. Ooh. What might we want to do with that, I wonder? How do we actually get anywhere? <laughs> Maybe I should've asked that first. Let's try putting that there, and then use this one to rotate the other thing. There we go, that makes a connection. Now that I've done this, what's changed? Oh, we have another path to take there. So now I need to rotate it back? Maybe? What if I do that? That seems to make sense. There we go. Then we can go around here. And I assume press the button again, right? Which allows us to access this area now. What does this rotate? Ah, okay. I sort of see how that's supposed to work. So now it's just a matter of getting to the exit, right? But this won't work, really. Doesn't matter which way that we have the button pressed, I don't think. Yeah, we're here! <laughs> Are these steps jagged? These steps don't look straight. Is that an optical illusion, or are these steps actually not straight? Am I losing my mind? These don't look straight at all. I'll have to take a closer look when we actually get in here for real. Alright, well, let's go back up here. Let's see if I can figure out what to do here. Oh crap, that's not what I wanted to do. Oops. Yeah, let's put that back. Yeah, I'll put that back on for now. Maybe we need to rotate a few more things here. Why is there so much walking? There is a lot of walking around in these puzzles. How does that work out for us? Oh, I think that's it, actually. Yeah, we're done. Okay. <laughs> a lot of these pebbles seem to boil down to ro orient everything one way to press a button and then go back and orient everything back the other way again. Right, what about this one? Another plant right at the beginning? Achievement unlocked, the nature. I don't understand what I'm doing with these achievements, but, uh... Okay, that's interesting. What does this do? Oh, there's a button down there, huh? What 
What does that button do for us? Anything useful? Also, let me get this straight. This thing's only purpose in life... ...is to make a button accessible to us, that we can press, and then immediately rotate this back. And there's no other reason, nothing else for this to connect to. If we ever- if we never need to use this for anything else, I'm gonna be pretty upset, because this is a useless contraption right here. That just adds fake difficulty. It's basically just tedious. What does this take us? Okay, I'm here now. Uh... I grew a plant! I have a plan to know how to use it. These steps, they- the steps still look crooked to me. I swear they're crooked. Right, well that's clearly not the right thing to do. Maybe we don't need to press the switch just yet. It's annoying that we have to rotate this every time we want to press the switch. Interesting. This was a mistake. <laughs> Oops. What am I doing in here? Is there no way out from where I was? That blocks me from getting to that. Hmm... Maybe I did need to push the switch. I don't see anything else to do. Or maybe I was supposed to do something first and I'm actually trapped and I just don't know it? this rotate? What does that align with, actually? That looks like it just lines into space. I don't think that... Like, it might make me land there? I don't know, though. But there, there's no way to, to rotate it, because I've already gone past that point. Maybe it is lined up. Wait, what was it lined up? Supposed to be lined up with? Yeah, I think it is actually lined up, and it just didn't look like it. I think, though, I have to restart the whole level, though. It wasn't clear that I was trapped, but apparently I was trapped. So... Yeah, I think I had to do that first. Not very obvious that I was trapped. That's generally bad map design, when you can't tell that you're trapped until you exhaust all your options and you realize it. Here we go. What is this for? Huh? I don't even know what orientation I want that in. Have I ever- have I even been there before? How do I want that oriented? How was it oriented at the beginning? Hold on a second, let me restore for my checkpoint here. So that's that, right? That's how it orients at the start. Oh, that's what I couldn't see, so I need to click it twice. Okay.
Yeah, I need to point up. Well... There's no up. There is no up. There is no spoon, there is no up. There we go. This seems like progress. I'll save here. Now what? Uh... Oh crap! Well... I guess I can only fall into this, right? That just kills me. Um... Did I trap myself again? There's nowhere else for this thing to point, right? Yeah, that's like the only way it's useful to me. Um, Was I supposed to rotate this first? I think I was. Well, crap. Gotta restart. Why is it so annoying to press this button? Like, why couldn't this button just be right where this thing is? There's no reason to make it rotate like this. Oh, that's not right. Is there another bridge that appears? I can't- I don't know. Either way, I'm saving here. There is! That's devious! Why would you put that one there if it's never meant to be used? That's just there to trick the player. That's not nice. I don't agree with that. That's not something that should be done. Yeah, here we go. This is the end of this level. I was definitely not a fan of this. There's so many ways to get trapped without realizing it. Not to mention you tried to fool the player. Okay. Can I not reach that from here? Why would I want it to point any other direction, except for up? If it doesn't- if we don't ever need to make it point another direction, I'm gonna be kind of... disillusioned about this. Ooh, that's cool. What does this button do? to just land right back here, so... not really that useful. I'll leave it as is for now. I 
press the button from here, which is interesting. What does this rotate? What even is that? Oh, that's the exit, huh? Okay then. I wonder, can we fall into it from there? We've never done that before, but... Wouldn't surprise me. to go into this right now, that would be a trapping situation, wouldn't it? No, that's the wrong one. What is this one? This one rotates the thing in the center, right? Yeah. Technically only has two positions. Because it's symmetrical. Have I been there yet? How do I get there? What rotates that? Was it that? Did I just put it in the wrong orientation? Pretty good chance that I did. Right, let's go try this again and put it back in the right orientation. There's a lot of unnecessary walking here. Like, there's not even much to this puzzle, it's just a lot of walking and rotating things until you can get to where you want to go. Maybe I have to do that first, and then I can put it back the way it was before? I'm not clear on the concept. There's no dashed line, so I have no idea what that other thing will rotate. That's not helpful. If I just fall down here, there's- there's not much I can do, really. And I can't fall onto that, because I'm too far away. So what am I meant to be doing here? What does that line up with? The air. Let's try all the orientation of this and see where this makes us fall. To our death? That's definitely to our death. That's also definitely to our death. Yep, okay, well. I'm not gonna try the other orientation because they're clearly just gonna make me die. So I don't know why we would ever touch that again, now that we've got it the way we want it. Which means we only use it once. What about this? I think it must be something to do with that that I'm not understanding. Guess we better try every possible combination!
I don't think that's gonna do anything for us, but we can try. Why is there so much walking around? Why is this a two-block gap instead of a one-block gap? The world may never know. What am I standing on? I triggered this glitch again where I'm just standing on nothing. Oh, and somehow I could walk up again. Wait, what was different about this from before? What does this rotate? Oh, you're kidding me. Great, which orientation does this need to be in? So see, this is... Hmm... So this rotates the exit, huh? Well... Hmm... Which way do I even want the exit to be rotated at? I'm a bit confused here. Let's just put that there. Maybe this is not the final episode after all. Uh... Right, I need to do... No, I don't need to remove that one at all. Do that. Press that. I'm not sure if that's intended, but it works. Then which way do I need the exit oriented? Actually, how do I get out of this predicament now? Are you kidding me? That's why I need to rotate that multiple times? To just not trap myself? That is cruel. That is so cruel. Not cool. C-R-U-E-L. Right? Cruel? That's how you spell cruel? <laughs> yeah, not- not much a fan of that, to be honest. Let me click everything once. Yeah. How did I mess that up? I don't know. This allows me to rotate the exit. I'm not sure which way to rotate it, though. And then I can get back to the start, at least. Wait, what? No, I have to go this way. And this is the fastest I can move. Rolling around at the speed of snails. Right. And I wanted the exit the other way, because of course I did. At least this part's a bit more forgiving. Right, I need to go this way. This is the way I need to go. <laughs> There's so much walking around. There we go, now I can finally leave. level are we on? 
28. Hmm. I might just keep going. Or not. I think I'm gonna stop here, actually. So, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video. Goodbye!